door test, which is a portion of a full energy audit. Um, it's something that we have the um, equipment for, so we do uh, test in and test out before every project to see uh, how much the house leaks before and how much we can affect it during our building process. Uh, the first thing we'll do is go to the thermostat. This house only happens to have one thermostat. We'll turn the system to off. Uh, make sure we're not pulling anything through the HVAC system. Make sure you check the attic access and make sure you have it sealed as tight as possible. Make sure all the windows are down in a secure position. Uh, these windows are old double hung, so this may be a source of air leakage during our blower door test. To leave the door open um, so that the air can move throughout the house. So after you've done every room, you'll leave the door open and move on with the test. Make sure that you turn the all gas appliances off, turn the pilot lights off on your kitchen, uh, don't have it baking. And make sure your, again, your kitchen exhaust fan and your bath fans along with your dryer are all turned off. Here, what we wanna do is uh, turn the hot water to the pilot position. <clears throat> And uh, we would turn the furnace off as well if we had one down here. We have a boiler in this case. Um, and we'll put our keys over here so that when, we make, when we're done with the blower door test, we come back down here, turn the hot water, and make sure that the pilot and everything is running so uh, the homeowner has hot water. So what we have here is a blower door kit. Uh, lots of different manufacturers on that. Uh, pretty standard. We're going to go ahead and set this up in the door frame. Uh, get the blower door tent around it, get the fan in there, and uh, get ready to pressurize this house. So we got our fan in the blower door, and we're going to go ahead and set up the thermometer on the door. Even though we do blower door tests all the time, um, to help our field employees understand the natural paths that uh, air leakage occurs, we're going to fill this house with theatrical smoke. So since we already have the blower door set up, what we're going to do is reverse the flow of the fan, put the house under just a little bit uh, just a little bit of positive air pressure so we can exaggerate the situation. What this shows me is that we have lots of places where we have leakage, particularly up in the attic where the eaves meet the house. And also around the windows, uh, not so much the window panes themselves, but where the windows meet the jams as well as the doors. What that air leakage in the attic is uh, suggesting is that the air is leaking through the second floor up into the attic um, and then getting out. One of the ways that we will remedy that is by making sure that we seal top plates and lights and make sure we have uh, increased insulation values around the perimeter.